Hey guys, wanted to do a little tool review for you. Uh, this is a little drill that Tamaya makes. It's awesome, guys. You got to get one of these, man. It is the coolest thing. Um, it's it's great because it's it's uh, it's powerful, but it's low speed, so you can drill plastic and not worry about you know burning it up or the the plastic, not worry about it melting. In other words. Um, it uses the same size uh, collets as a Dremel. The Dremel collets will fit this. They're loose, but the nut uh, centers the collet. I'll explain here in a minute. The coolest thing about this little drill is that it's a model. How cool is that? I don't know why. I just love that. It's the builder in me, I guess. Comes in different colors. You got your linkage. Uh, battery contact points, things like that. Little motor, uh, screws, washers. This is actually a replacement I bought because I left the batteries in my other one and it killed the motor. The, the corrosion worked its way up the contacts and got to the motor. It's nice when you have to buy another whole drill just to get the motor. I, I could have probably found the motor, but I didn't want to screw with it. I figured this way I have extra spare parts. Empty bag. Uh, bit up. Some collets. The drive shaft, the nut, comes with a couple drill bits. Then you got the the gears, and then the body of the unit. Some uh, comes with a little bit of uh, I think that says lithium on it. I'm not sure. Some a little grease for the gears on the inside. more internal parts but what it builds is this cool little guy right here this is the coolest tool guys um, it comes with two collets which is this piece right here one you know fairly large for that size drill bit I had to squeeze that one in there and then one that's really small but it doesn't go down to the really, really small bits, the like hair size, which you really shouldn't be drilling with a motorized drill bit with a bit that small anyways. But like I was saying before, the Dremel collets will fit in here. And the reason that I use the Dremel collets, this is a Dremel collet. And I'll show you the difference between them. Where's my other color? Remember, always be organized. Organization is the key. This is the Tamaya collet. And this is the Dremel collet. And if you can see, the bottom of the Tamaya collet is thicker. And what that does is it centers the collet in the drill chuck or socket shaft thick of mahui um but like i was saying when you put a dremel collet in it the beveled part of the dremel collet will get centered by the inverted uh convex of the nut in other words you put it in here and you put your nut on and then when the nut contacts the collet it straightens it out then the tighter you go it locks it down this is your lock you press in for you know when you want to tighten your your nut here you can lock it on I've taken the batteries out always take the batteries out if you get one guys I made that mistake Little side pops off 
and you put your little batteries in. Dirty. You see? See, it, it doesn't spin fast. It's got a lot of power, guys. This thing drills really good. I was really surprised, but the gear reduction in it, you know, really makes it powerful. But you can, uh, like I was saying, you can turn this on. Well, you gotta press trigger. Which way? Lock. Come on now. I know it's supposed to. Well, somehow it's supposed to lock the trigger. See? Always be prepared. I'm not sure why, but it's supposed to lock the trigger where it continuously drills. Just like a regular drill. Maybe I broke it. I've had this for a while. I use it all the time. But you could put uh, your Dremel bits in it when you use your Dremel, Dremel collet. All kinds of drill bits. You know, uh, buffing stones. Plastic brushes. Just whatever you have. Um, like I was saying, for the really tiny drill bits, like what's in here, I don't use a power drill, I just use a, a, a pin vise. I had a real nice pin vise and I can't find it. But I've been using this one lately. Got two size chucks on it. But this is a really cool tool to have, guys. Uh, it'll really help you if you do a lot of drilling. If you do a lot of scratch building, this is a must have. So get one, build it. And remember to take your batteries out. Don't be stupid like Ben did. Leave the batteries in and let it kill the drill. Alright, just wanted to share that. See ya.